this literally came in the mail the other day and i am actually still shocked that i monetized like it still just feels like a dream hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel as you guys can probably see from the title already today i'm going to be sharing with you guys how i got monetized here on youtube i got my first paycheck the other day and i'm going to be sharing how much money i received for my first paycheck at the end of this video so stay tuned i got monetized in january 2022 so it has not been a long long time but getting to that monetization state takes forever and sometimes it's quicker for other people but it took me about a year to get monetized which is why i'm going to be sharing some tips and tricks with with you guys so that you can get your channels monetized as well okay so to begin with i'm going to talk about the requirements that you need to be able to get monetized you need 4,000 watch hours and a thousand subscribers obviously this growth is very different for several people i actually reached a thousand subscribers back in july 2021 what i first focused on is raising my subscribers before thinking about my watch hours because you need a lot of supporters in order to gain more watch hours and then when you reach a thousand subscribers you can fully put your focus on gaining watch hours for any of you guys who don't know watch hours are basically the amount of hours that your viewers have been watching your channel so you would need 4,000 hours of watch time to be able to get monetized you can't get monetized just like that it's gonna take a lot of hard work and work ethic to really get monetized and start earning money from your youtube channel so that was kind of like a little small minor tip but now we're going to be getting into the real actual advice tips on getting monetized so tip number one is get your channel out there. You really need to promote your channel. Social media is such a widespread area to like really promote your channel for other viewers to watch. So you need other platforms to really promote your channel instead of just YouTube. So use social media to your advantage because it's going to help you a lot. I even have an Instagram dedicated to my YouTube channel, which I'll have on the side of the screen because it really helps you connect to other viewers and other YouTubers out there or small creators just like you. Use Instagram, Pinterest, Visco if you want. Some creators specifically i have seen don't have any other social medias linked to their youtube channel so it kind of limits them from a lot of other youtubers who actually have other social media that they're spreading their youtube channel on tip number two is kind of cliche but it is very important you really have to enjoy the journey on youtube if you're doing youtube just for the purpose of gaining money you're not going to get anywhere like youtube is a job it's something that you need to be committed to if you're wanting to gain money on but that shouldn't be what's driving you to make videos because you're not going to get monetized like that i have had like five different or like four different channels in the past that have not worked out just because i kept switching between ideas and i wasn't enjoying what videos and content i was creating but that actually helped me grow as an individual because my editing got better i understand youtube and how it works a lot better so yeah i would just say if this is your first youtube channel i would say just experiment with it and see if you actually enjoy it because i know i've switched from different channels and different niches like quite often tip number three is check your analytics on a daily basis i made the biggest mistake by not doing this analytics are so important to look at it tells you in what part of your video that viewers often leave it also tells you where your viewers stayed the most in your video so you can grow off of that and add that more into your other videos and honestly it can take a while to really understand how analytics work and stuff but if you don't get it i would totally recommend watching some analytic based videos because it really helps you understand them a lot better and it helps me understand where i'm going wrong with my channel and what i should do to really grow from that tip number four is so important and if you want to take anything away from this video for sure take this tip because i've seen so many people make mistakes with this one make sure to set up your youtube channel before posting any videos there have been people who don't have a proper channel art who don't have a profile picture who don't have their description set up who don't have their social medias linked like there is just a mess when i started this channel i actually made my channel art i put my profile picture up before uploading my first video and that is important to do because you really need your channel to look appealing because people are not going to stay on there if you're just just posting videos but you don't have a proper channel layout or whatever so i recommend go to your channel right after this video and check if you have everything in place tip number five is finding the right editing tools i think i've said this in a lot of my small youtuber advice related videos you're going to be using it for the longest time ever to really get those watch hours and those subscribers so i would recommend really find the editing apps that you like using i personally have been using vllo for a year now and i still continue to use the free version as well like, i have got really used to the app itself 
yourself and it's just so easy and quick to edit for me tip number six is stop comparing your channel with other channels i think i've mentioned this a lot too but i'm gonna go a little bit more in depth about what i mean you're not gonna be able to grow if you're comparing your channel to other people because everyone's growth is different but i just want to say you're gonna have to be very patient and everyone's youtube journey is very different for me it took about half a year to really get to a thousand subscribers but for some people it may take two years or three years it really depends that's why it's so important to really just focus on your own channel and just focus on one thing at a time comparing yourself to another person or being inspired by another person are two very different things so if you're being inspired by another channel and you really love their content that's a good mindset to have but if you're comparing your channel to them and just dreading on why your channel isn't growing as much as them that's not going to get you anywhere tip number seven is make quality videos and make sure that they're long videos so important to have longer videos i'm just realizing this now because if you really want those watch hours you need your videos to be at least like 10 or 9 minutes you can't have them as like six or five minutes but just realize if you want your viewers to stick around for a long time you need your videos to be long so that when your viewers are actually watching the entire video you're actually gaining a lot more watch hours than you are from a six minute video even recently i have my videos at like nine or eight minutes and i still want them to be longer like i want them to be at least 11 or like 10 minutes at the most but yeah i am learning myself i'm trying to get my videos to be longer get as much content as you can in there put more talking portions in anything like that that will make the video longer because that's going to help you really gain the watch time and the hours that you need along with quantity we're also going to be talking about quality you need your videos to be quality content and it's not boring content or there's a lack of editing in it like you really need to put a lot of work into it tip number eight is ask your subscribers for what content they want to see from you, you really want to make content that your viewers are actually going to watch maybe use your community tab post or like on one of your videos ask in the comments ask your viewers what videos they want to see from you and then you'll get some feedback and then you can make content based off of that so yeah, those were the tips that I wanted to give you guys. I honestly just covered some of the most important ones to me. So if you want to go check out my small YouTuber advice video, a lot of other tips are mentioned in there as well. But now it's the time that you guys have been waiting for. I actually got my paycheck the other day. Still so crazy to me that I'm still monetized. But yeah, I am super happy knowing that this is my first paycheck. I honestly don't know what my first payment for this is going to be. I want to really better my YouTube channel. And maybe one day I'll actually be able to invest and buy a camera for this YouTube channel. But I would have never been able to be holding this paycheck without you guys so thank you guys so much for this but yeah now for the moment that you guys have been waiting for i have actually earned 120 dollars plus 80 cents for my first paycheck but yeah that is my first payment i am still crazy again i want to thank you guys because this wouldn't have been possible without you guys and because of you guys watching my videos constantly and staying updated with my youtube channel i'm actually able to make this video and share with you guys my first paycheck so yeah this is only possible because of you guys but yeah, I think that's all for this video. I really hope that this video did help you guys out. And I want to wish you guys the best for your channels as well. I hope you guys do get monetized very soon if you're close or you're just starting off your YouTube channel. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below this money emoji. I don't know, monetization related. Do check out my other small YouTuber advice video and my YouTube advice playlist because I give you guys a lot of tips on there. And it will be really helpful for your own YouTube channel. So go check that out. Let me know if you want me to do a part two to this video because I for sure can see me doing one in the future again and yeah just a reminder i do post every week on sunday and i will see you guys next week with a brand new video bye guys